Indian Coin View Presents Coins from Indian Princely States Part 5, Miwa Princely State, 1 Anna, 1943 Miwa State, also known as Udaipur Princely State, was an independent state in northwestern India prior to the formation of the Indian Republic. Miwa was founded by Baparawal, formerly a chieftain of the Mauri King of Chitta, who acquired control of Chitta in 728. Nagda was the first capital of Miwa and continued to be so until 948 when the ruler Olat moved the capital from Nagda, Rajasthan to Aha. Udaipur was founded in 1559 by Maharana Uday Singh II as the final capital of the erstwhile Miwa kingdom. In 1568, the Mughal Emperor Akbar captured the fort of Chitta, and Uday Singh moved the capital to the site of his residence, which became the city of Udaipur. In 1615, after four decades of skirmishing, Miwa and the Mughals entered into a treaty under which Miwa territory under the Mughals' possession was returned in exchange for the Crown Prince of Miwa attending the Mughal court and Miwa providing a force of 1,000 horsemen to the Mughals. By 1818, the armies of Holka, Skindia, and Tok had plundered Miwa, pauperizing its ruler and people. As early as 1805, Maharana Bhim Singh of Miwa approached the British for assistance but the Treaty of 1803 with Skindia prevented the British from entertaining the request. But by 1817, the British too were anxious to have alliances with Rajput rulers and the Treaty of Friendship, alliances and unity was concluded between Miwa and East India Company on 13 January 1818. Udaipur is famous for its brave rulers such as Maharana Pratap Singh who has great importance in the history of medieval India. It is also famous for its architectural marvels such as Chittorgarh Fort which is one of India's largest and most beautiful forts. It is also famous for Kumbalga Fort, which has the second longest wall in the world after Great Wall of China. The famous James Bond movie Octopussy was also shot in Udaipur. Currently it is part of state of Rajasthan in northwestern part of India. One Anna was a standard circulation coins in Udaipur issued by Maharana Bhupal Singh during his reign. Maharana Bhupal Singh of Miwa was born to Maharana Fata Singh. At a young age of 16, he was paralyzed from waist down but this did not deter him from replicating courage and bravery of his forefathers. He ascended the throne in 1930 after his father's death but was exercising power since 1921 after the British curbed his father Maharana Fata Singh's power and advised him to resign in favor of his nominated heir. Maharana Bhupal Singh was given the power to rule and he steered India during the era of turbulence, when the nation was fighting for independence. He could foresee the changes that were happening across the country and encouraged political and social transformations. After independence from the British Empire, he merged his state into the Rajasthan Union and was appointed as the Maharaj Pramukh of Rajasthan by the Indian government, the only title of its kind in India. He served his people and their interests even though the sovereignty of Miwa had ended. One Anna was a standard circulation coin in Udaipur issued by Bhupal Singh during his reign. This was issued in 1943 AD. The state was following Vikram Samvat calendar and hence 2000 was written on the coin which is corresponding to 1943 in Christian calendar. One anna was won by 16th part of a rupee. The coin is made of copper metal. It weighs around 4.3 grams and has an octagonal shape. It has a diameter of 22 millimeters. In the obverse of the coin in Devanagari script it is written Chitrakutu de Poor. In reverse in Divnagari script it is written Doshti with London, which means friendship with London and 2000, the Vikram Samvak year of its minting, that is 1943 AD. Researchers have mentioned about existence of verities of this coin on the basis of differences in shape and size of dots on the picture in lower half portion of obverse side. Anyway this a beautiful coin with a unique shape form history of Indian princely state coins. The coin has a market price between 300 to 1000 rupees in India depending on the grade usually. This may also increase on if the coin is in great condition. If you find this video helpful in some way, like the video. Also do subscribe to the YouTube channel and click the bell icon so that you will not be missing any videos on coins and currencies. 
Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.